Hey guys. Just waiting for a couple of you guys to come in. How y'all doing? Today is Thursday. Hi, Selena the Fox. How are you? Thank you guys for coming in. Foxy Channel, hi. What's up, guys? So, what you guys are seeing right now, this is the uh, the CD slash DVD. And um, th this I actually had gotten it yesterday. Um, and this huge box right here is the vinyl. I haven't opened it. I only I only slit it open so that I could like once you know once we start this video, so I could just open it easily. Uh, thank you much. Thank you so much, Heart Zone Matthew. Hi, how are you? So again, like I said, this is the CD slash DVD. I just got in this yesterday, and the big box is the um, the vinyl. Um, Alicia, hi! Shout out to New Zealand. Thank you guys so much. So, um, striking differences, of course, from the uh, the design. I I really like the the letters. If you could if you could see really clearly, they're like um. Uh, it's purple and then uh, you could like it, it has a nice feel to it. It's really professional looking um, And then on the inside for the CD and the DVD you have one side that says uh, CD and the other side it says DVD and it's like the same tracks, right? Um, you have very interestingly, you know the CD the disco melody starts off, off at 738 minutes and then Disco Melody is longer in the DVD version. Um, where did I get it from? I got it from the shop selena.com. So that's like the official website of the of Selena's stuff. The box, again, like the box uh, just arrived today. That's just a, that's, uh, I'm going to open it and it's going to have the vinyl inside. But I just wanted to show off the, the, the CD first. Um... Let me see if I could just there you go. So this is this is what the CD looks like. Very simple, purple, um, no design on it. It's just uh, uh very simple. How much is it? I think for the CD slash DVD, I think I, I got it for uh nine ninety nine, I think. I think it's nine ninety nine. I'm not sure. I, I forgot it because I ordered this like a month ago, that's why. So that that one is the the DVD and then the let me see the the DVD. I mean, the CD was purple and the DVD is white. And again, it's, it's just very simple, nothing too complicated, right? Um, immediately, what I had seen uh, from the back, uh, again, it's just like the the same as the front, right? Um, but I did notice some typos on the the CD DVD. And there's a typo on here on the Instagram and it says uh, Selena L Q official and for her the Instagram the the it, it's a typo so it's not supposed to have an L in between it's supposed to just be Selena Q official so there's a typo on here and then there's also another typo here for the snapchat was Selena L it says Selena L Q official but in reality it's supposed to just be Selena Q official. So that's just some typos. I don't know how that uh was missed. Um but yeah that's just some of the mistakes that they made. Uh in general from what I've seen I already played the C D and the D V D. The D V D actually is in my opinion it has a, a better quality. Um the sound Oh, at least in the comparison to the older DVD, the the concert, uh, you could it's more based on her voice, and the instruments are are dimmed and the audio is as well. I mean, the audience is as well. But in the in this new one, uh, what's great is that all of all of those factors are enhanced, so you could hear her voice better. You could hear uh the instruments and the crowd a lot better. Um, the only criticism that I do have again is that they um is that they have a typo so there's two typos on here for the in, for the instagram and the snapchat 
usernames they're incorrect and another critique that i have is that the uh the dvd for the intro of disco medley is actually cropped out so it's a lot shorter from the it's a lot shorter from the original dvd uh if you could remember the original dvd you know she's she's getting on the the little cart with the with the horse and she's waving at people and then she starts to proceed uh, to in, to get towards the stage uh, but in this DVD that all of that is actually cropped out and then she's already on the cart and she's waving at people and then uh, it only takes probably like a minute or two until she gets on stage um, but the, I mean that's the only critique that's the I was a little disappointed in that because I didn't think that they were going to take any footage out. Um, if anything, I, I assumed that it was just going to be the same as the DVD and they were just going to remaster it. But uh, in terms of quality, it's great. Um, when it comes to the the footage that you get, it, they they do crop out the, the beginning, like the intro uh, from her getting on the cart with the horse, uh, which is really sad that they did that. Um... But enough of this, then let's get straight to the vinyl. Okay? Ooh. Yes, the vinyl's still for sale. You can still purchase it. Wow. So I actually got two guys, so. So it's beautiful. Immediately, uh, it's just like a bigger version of this one. <laughs> Basically, you know, it's it's so pretty. Uh, the vinyl, I think the vinyl was about thir almost $30. So I think it was $29.99. Um, yeah, so you can still purchase it on shopselena.com. Or if you like, you could. There's other stores that you could even get it at Walmart now. I think Target sells them now. So uh, if you want to get this really fast, I'd go in person to the stores. And at the back, I really like this. I really like this. Um, in comparison to the CD and the DVD, uh, you can see that the bottom part is cropped out. So here you can actually see the full, the the full picture here. So that's the difference that you'll get from the DVD and the DVD, CD, and the vinyl is that you get the full picture here. Unfortunately, I cannot play a song because, you know, it, it's, it's copyrights and um, I have to... I have to get it, uh, I have to see which songs I could do it first, so because this is a live video, I can't do it, um, but I, I will try to do something similar where I could show what it sounds like. But yeah, so if you could, you could see that the, the, the vinyl has a full picture versus this one is just, it's kind, it's, cut, it's kind of cropped from the bottom. Um, interestingly, it doesn't have, like, it doesn't have, like, the social media uh stuff on the back so i guess that's that's different from it you won't see that on here um and it comes with two it's it's two discs and each disc has two sides to it so it's basically it's, it's still the same concert but obviously it's it's um it's going to be separated so i'm going to try to open it let me see if i could open it with my nails i don't want to it's pretty hard to do this because I'm holding the camera on one side and uh, okay I got it I think I got it yeah I got it there you go in terms of the of the Photoshop in here I really like it it's something uh, different that we haven't seen from her album covers so that's pretty cool Okay. So the inside is there's no design on the inside, and again you get to see um, a disc one like the the song list from disc one, and then the song list from disc number two, and then here is the actual records. 
So this is uh, this number two. It's, it's pretty simple. I think it's black. Yeah, it's black. I actually do have a vinyl record that I could play this with. So I'll probably play that later on. Um, but yeah, that's that's for uh, this number two. And then let's look at this number one. I didn't know they were going to be reversed like this. Oh, so okay. So this one is actually purple. Monica, do you have the... You see, you have the biggest fan than us. You have everything. I don't have every everything. I wish I had more, more of her vintage stuff. Like, I don't own her perfume. I don't own, like, certain things that came out when she was alive, you know. Um, some of, like, the rare posters. I do have some rare posters, but not, not all of them, you know. Um, but, yeah, that's that's um that's pretty cool if i if i had all those cool things so that's this is this number one really pretty i like it still thought i haven't seen a monica seen the Mon biggest fan than yourself monica thank you so much heart zone well i have another cool thing that i want to show you guys apart from this uh it's pretty cool, and I just recently got it, what, like a few weeks ago? Have you been to the museum? Yes, I have. I have been to the museum, but the, I've been to the museum like two years ago and haven't gone since, but uh, I'm planning to go back soon, probably next year for Fiesta de la Flor. I'm planning to go. What's your favorite song by Selena? I don't know. There's so many really great songs. I totally wish that... I wish that Selena would have performed to Fotos y Recuerdos in this concert uh, because it is part of the Amor Prohibido album. And that's basically what she sang in this concert or mostly was the Amor Prohibido songs, Amor Prohibido album songs. Uh, but I don't know. There's so many songs. Have you met Abraham and Suzette? Yes, I have. I have met them. I've also met A.B. Quintanilla and Chris Paris. Uh, Chris Paris, I met them. I met him like three times already, which is crazy. What is my least favorite song? I don't have a least favorite song. I really like all of her songs. They're all so beautiful. But let me show you guys what I wanted to show you guys. <laughs> Hold on one second. All right. So I just got this. Um, what was it? A few... A few uh, weeks ago, it is an Adriana Papel blazer, and if you notice it, it is a blazer that Selena had done at least two, two photo shoots in, and it was originally in black, um, but this one is actually in purple. You've probably seen me uh, wear this before. Uh, in one of my videos, so it's really, really pretty. I was so lucky to find it. And when that once I found it, I was just so happy that I finally got one of these. And it's really pretty. I like that it's a it's a purple color. I found it in purple, not in black. I was looking for black, um, but yeah, I couldn't find it. Oh, you said Joshua says I was on your Instagram live yesterday, and, and my name on IG is Steven. Oh, hey Steven, how are you? So this is this is a blazer. I'm so happy that I found it. It's in it's in small. It's a size small. So it's a size size four. Yeah. So it's so pretty and it has some nice buttons on the on the sleeves, which is really cute. Uh, but yeah, you know, so Selena would have probably rocked this if she would have found the purple one. She would have probably worn this one too. Like, but she mostly wore. She only I only seen her in the black one. But yeah, they did have a Selena perfume. I think she was working on it herself, but the tragedy happened. They released it after she passed away. Yeah, she released some perfumes after they released them for her. I mean, I'm new. Coffee Demon, you're new on YouTube and you need more subscribers. Hey, what's up? How do you feel when Selena has had passed away? I was only like two years old when she passed away. I didn't, I couldn't understand at the time what was going on, but my dad did, you know, he was working and uh he just when they heard about her the news of, of her passing away you know everyone was shocked you know 
If you could tell Selena one thing before she passed, what would you tell her? I would have told her. I would have told her to not worry that she made a uh, huge impact in the lives of of uh, all the young generation and everyone that she's ever met. That she has impacted people. And um, if there was no way for me to help her, I would have told her that to you know to rest and to to uh, to understand that we're all never going to forget her. That's what I would have told her. What do you think of El Secreto de Selena? Oh, that's something that's something that I already talked about in some of my other videos. I don't want to give so much of, of attention to that. All I just want to say is that it's BS, you know. Uh, other than that, I'm not really going to give that much exposure to it. Put a dead emoji if you hate Yolanda. Oh. <laughs> okay, so that's this. So let me show you guys something else. I have a mess here, but don't worry about it. <laughs> so you guys have seen me do the this um, bustier tutorial, right? And so I'm going to be selling uh, these pink bustiers soon. And I have one already almost finished. So this one, uh, it just needs the other beads. And then I'm going to put the bow and then the pink straps on it. Uh, I have a, my collection here of bustiers. I have... Uh, I haven't worn this one in a long time, but you know, everyone knows which one this is. I have this one that I worked on for that. This one is like that, um, what is it called? Like the Far West Rodeo concert that she did. I have this one I'm going to sell too. Like it doesn't fit me anymore. So I'm going to sell this one. This one's like a, like a cheetah, uh, bustier. Thank you so much, Jamie. And I have a, the red bustier all the way in the back. There's so many things that I have that I'm still working on. Uh, but this one, this, this pink one, I'm gonna sell this one. This one, this one's I'm gonna sell. And then I have my own right here. Yeah, I have my own right here. And I haven't even done a video of this one with wearing this one, but this is another one where she has like some ruffle sleeves and then, um, uh, she wears it with like some bell bottom pants so this is I haven't I haven't done the video on YouTube with wearing this but I have worn it for some of my gigs before honestly the TV series 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 will make my life and Monica should cast as Selena I will if anything I will probably cast as a little Selena <laughs> but I would never be part of a uh, I will never be part of a series that degrades her legacy you know What is my favorite Selena outfit? I honestly like all of them. I really like how I look in jackets. Maybe jackets are like the, the jacket type of outfits I, I really like. This is why we love you, Monica. I love everything you show us. And I also love how you show Selena stuff too. Thank you so much. Do you have a camera or phone so I can know how to make lives on YouTube? Maybe I could do a tutorial on that soon. The outfit I wanted you to wear, the one with the ruffles, the the ruffles. Oh, that's not the one. There's another one that looks kind of different. Well, guys, thank you guys so much for tuning in. Um, I'm going to watch. I'm go I mean, I'm sorry. I'm not going to watch. I'm going to listen to the vinyl and see how it sounds. But everything looks great to me. The only thing that they obviously need to fix is the typos that they have here. Like the typos are wrong. These 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 are not the usernames for their Instagram and Snapchat, so they need, they need to fix that. Um, other than that, this is beautiful. I really like it. Uh, I I like the design. It's it's different than what we've seen before. What's great that is that you could also download it digitally, so you don't have to actually purchase it. But it's always nice to get something physical, like a physical copy, right? Um, but yeah, guys, thank you guys so much for tuning in. How much for what, Lucero? <clears throat> Thank you, Julian. Bye, Heart Zone. <coughs> Sorry, I had to cough. Alright, guys. Thank you guys so much for tuning in. I'll see you guys next time, alright?
Bye. Have a good day.